What is up, guys? It's OJ back at it again with another Clash Royale episode. I've got something really fun in store for you guys today. I recently got 20 wins in the Modern Royale Challenge, and I was undefeated in the deck that I used at the end of the challenge. I got beaten with this deck, tried my current deck for another battle, lost again, and then I went 12-0. So as you can see, 20 wins in the Modern Royale Challenge. These were my last battles. I'll just scroll through to show you that I won my last 12. And then we've got the two losses with this Bowler um, Graveyard deck. Shout out to B Mills in Nova One for that. Thank you. That got me eight wins. And, um, and so also today, we're gonna bring you the new emotes. So the Piglet emotes, and I have yet to hear what they sound like. Uh, I have not bought them in my in my shop, so we're going to buy them right now. So, hope you guys enjoy this. Never bought, like, Face ID, it worked. All right, gotta love iPhone 10. Okay, so let's see. Um, this is my level eight account. I'm not upgrading anything really, but um, uh, Valkyrie or Battle Ram? I don't know, I'm just not like a big Valkyrie user, so, um, and I like the idea of Bridge Fan. I'm trying to get uh, more hogs, so um, that's all I request in clan. Um, let's see, I hate the furnace, so I'm gonna use, go for the tombstone. Um, I'm enjoying mortar, I've done well with that in the past. Let's see, I need, uh, the Ice Golem is a great card. Uh, I could use, <laughs> could do so many things with it. Anyway, the Cannon Cart is massive right now. What kind of legendary are we gonna get, guys? I don't know, I'm hoping for like Mega Knight or Electro Wizard. I think once I hit 4,000 trophies, I'm gonna upgrade. So let's see if I can use any of these. What do we have? Mega Knight, sweet. Uh, so we will go with Mega Knight. And now we got the piglet emotes too. Awesome. All right, let's go to our emote deck and let's try these out. Jeez. Um, so use that. Uh, the first one, I don't know. Okay, that's good. That's funny. Uh, let's see what this one sounds like. Oh, so I wonder if this one sounds like the hog. What do you think, guys? I don't know. Oh use put in there similar yeah man that's gonna be annoying and then what do we have here oh guys and watch my next episode because i'll use i'll use these emotes in my next episode oh that's a good one so sleeping and then what do we have here let's see i like the kissy face so okay so like clearing your throat there we go it's fun stuff Okay, so right now I'm going to show you guys. So a couple people in my clan um, actually got, uh, well, my co-leader got um, 20 wins with this as well. And then uh, possibly we have some more 20 win people with this. The counter pushes, so I'm going to take you through this deck. Uh, the, yeah, it's, it's just a great legendary deck. It's got the Mega Knight. Um, it's got the Mega Minion, which is huge. So Mega Mega. And um, yeah, so I would wait for my opponent to play. And I'll just go through play-by-play play here. I try to play passive and get um, use out of my Mega Knight and his jumping, his you know in his drop ability when he comes into play. And so just cycling here, not wanting or wanting to make sure I take care of that Sparky. And so and just just kind of cycling with the miner on the tower, just getting some chip damage so that I can follow up with the Electro Wizard on the Sparky. You know, I'm taking a little bit of damage, but that's okay, because like I said in the description of this of this shared battle is that the counter pushes with this deck are nasty. So hardly, like not all my troops have much life here, but I get the dash, the bandit dash, and then the Inferno Dragon takes care of the tower there, guys. So also uh, my background again is Indianapolis. So let me know guys in the comments if you've been to Indy before, if you, anything you like doing there. We live downtown. I really enjoy being downtown. We can almost see the Salesforce tower from, from our condo. And so
So not the best trade, but he played bats as well. So I put Mega Knight down on top of the Sparky before he, the Sparky was able to get a charge. And we are even on Elixir. And he, even before he's at full Elixir, he, he tries to battle ram me. But uh, the, the Electro Wizard does a good job uh, at the battle ram. And I wanted to make sure I didn't take any damage. So I went ahead and put down the Mega Minion. And here I'm just... So I love the use of all these... Um, so the bandit plus the, uh, plus, <laughs> no words today, guys, plus the miner is just, is just huge. It just continues your push, um, and you can just do great things with it. So, and then for my final win, uh, it was a bit closer, and so we'll watch that, and then that'll be the end of the episode, and I hope you guys can have some luck with this deck. So again, uh, play pa passively in the beginning, um, and then focus on the counter push, and when you have Inferno Dragon that's still alive, you have the Bandit that might be alive, and the Mega Minion, you just get so much value. In there. And you can do a really good job against, so this, in this case, I'm facing the Royal Hawks. And so um, I had to play, you know, I was confused about what to do here because it's like split push Royal Hogs. Okay, I just, I'll just split my Elixir up a little bit. So I'm not taking too much damage, and I want to wait um, for the, uh, to use the log on those Skeletons after the Skeleton Barrel bursts. And I'm trying to distract the hunter here, and so that allows my infer uh, my electro wizard to get good value there. And so let's see. So let's see. We're it's about even on elixir right now. So yeah, we're both at at about five elixir. So now he's got so he's got a little bit of bait here um, for my log. I you know I've got to log the rascals, but you can what you can also do is put the royal ghost on the rascal. Uh, chicks in the back and that took them out in one swing and then I have my log ready for when that pops and got it so it got the log perfectly there you know I've had to playing level one you have to you have to use uh, or be very careful with how you use the log and get as much value as you can on it so I think that's helped my miner just got absolutely destroyed there I was trying to let the miner tank a little bit for the mega minion but he played a lot of elixir too so again we're, it looks like we're up like one elixir here so and we have the um tower damage advantage and they're at you know 15 and that was in large part because of just what i was able to do with the minor tanking for the electro wizard so i just i just love that you don't want these days uh to uh, for a cannon cart to get on your um on your tower and i don't think he knows that i have mega knight at this point so i'm um, and he's putting everything at the bridge, so that just made me really happy. I was like, okay, all right, maybe I'll go undefeated. And um, as you guys know, I did. So I don't want, so the Magic Archer can be really, can get a lot of value if you let him. So I love that I could use a Miner for that. What I might actually also do is see how far I can push with this. Look at this counter push, guys, it's just insane. And then he's, he's trying to keep us from <laughs> pushing through for the three crown, but he can't. Counter push, Inferno Dragon, uh, followed up by the Electro Wizard and the Bandit. I mean, you just can't stop it. And the Miner coming in, he has nothing he can do. Nothing he can do, guys. Nothing he can do. And so what I wish is if this challenge put 20 wins in your profile, but unfortunately it doesn't. But you can have a lot of fun with it. Losses don't matter. So go ahead and use this deck. I will um, show it to you one more time here. And let's see. Yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this episode and a little shorter episode. Hopefully, I'll get like thousands of views. That would be amazing. Anyway, guys, I hope you're having a great weekend. Go and buy those emotes and have fun with them. So we'll go ahead and listen to them again here. Fun stuff. Uh-huh. And then this this probably going to be my favorite one. I wish I had the hog emotes, but I forgot to buy them. There it is. And with that, guys, Oche out. Thank you.